Italian national, in spite of the recent turmoil with the Ferrari McLaren showdown, uh, the opportunity to safely come to London, chair such an important meeting, and hopefully fly back safely. A clear proof of national dialogue, of inter international dialogue and tolerance that bodes well for the intercultural and interfaith dialogue. Ladies and gentlemen, in the next couple of days, we will receive an enormous, a tremendous amount of information of prime quality. And hopefully, by tomorrow night, we will, all of us, have become, at least to a certain extent, experts on Takaful and Rita Takaful. But this was uh, to be expected, given the high profile and experiences of, uh, of the speakers. What perhaps was not to be expected is that another fundamental concept that at the end of the day will make, will, will make the difference has been put at the very forefront of our conference. And on this particular aspect, I would like to draw your attention. This is the role that Islamic finance as a whole can or must play in establishing stronger better and above all lasting relationships between our two communities, both at the domestic level in each and every European Western country, as well as at the international level. This concept has been very well summarized in the title of the special address that will be given by the Honorable Alderman John Stutter, Lord Mayor of the City of London, Islamic Finance and, and I stress, and interfaith harmonization. Ladies and gentlemen, we know that we live in a very difficult times and perhaps even tougher times lie ahead. The necessity of finding a common ground of understanding and mutual, res and mutual respect has become urgent and imperative. The knotting of economic and financial ties is beyond any doubts a powerful tool in creating an environment of mutual respect. Where interests are shared and, and, uh, where interests are, shared and are uh, in common values and tolerance on both sides, common understanding will follow. No doubt, in this respect, it's not perhaps a case that two cities in the world, the two cities in the world, KL, which you know very well in London, where the multiracial and multi faith social fabric is the more advanced, are the two powerful forces behind today's event. But please, let's not fool ourselves. These two bright stars in a sky overcast by clouds do not exempt anybody sitting in this room in spite of his or her personal beliefs cultural or social background to assume his, her own responsibilities in understanding other people's values, respecting them, and in building bridges in his, her everyday activity. By doing so, we will make a favor to our own wallet and to our conscience as well by contributing at the same time to a more stable and safer environment. Thank you. Now I have the pleasure of uh, uh, 